First of all, I didn't even know XFL was starting. I happen to be going through a couple of ESPN channels and I saw the game going on. Okay. So that was quite wild to me. I was like, oh. In the first weekend of the opening weekend of the XFL 2023, it result it, it resulted in a very I mean if you compare it to other start of other spring leagues or even from the XFL in 2020 it's uh, it's a major setback yeah As you can see 1.5 million people watched on ABC the inaugural game for the 2023 one and the game number two on ESPN was 1.4 1.14, right? Sorry, 1.14, yeah, sorry. Yeah. 1.14. If you, if you compare it to last year's USFL, on both occasions, so both the, the inaugural game and the uh, game number two are almost half. Yeah. Almost half. Is this a bad thing or a good thing? It's it's I don't know if it's bad or good. I do so I want to I compare it more to let's say I think it's more interesting to compare it with XFL zone numbers before that. So if you see 2020, uh the opening game got 3.3 million, the second game got 3.3 million again, again on average, the third one as well. Uh, but you do see a decline, right? Um and all the all of the numbers you see a decline. So the first one seems to be the the opening nine seems to be the biggest one. Yeah. I think it was a very bad choice to open on well, clearly to open on uh, NBA uh, during NBA All Star Weekend. Yeah. I don't necessarily think that, or at least I don't know if if it's a bad idea that they started on uh, the weekend after. Because is it was it the first weekend after the Super Bowl? It's right after. Yeah, so I don't. Maybe that was that the timing wasn't that good. But then again, people are already into people are already into um, what's it called? They're already into football. So maybe you know. I mean, it's it's difficult to say whether or not that that timing is worse. Uh, NBA has seen, if I'm not mistaken, a decline in the amount of followers mm -hmm. or uh, watch. I think I don't know if that's the truth, actually. Maybe that's why that boy won the dunk contest. That boy dunked, I don't even know his name, Mac something. I think Mac, Mac, Mac something, yeah, yeah, it looks Mac like a Mac something. something. His, no disrespect, but this, this, <laughs> these dunks were crazy, yeah. but. But I mean, people do watch it, and it's different than like uh, NBA Finals game, uh, or at least an NBA playoff game. The NBA, the All Star game, the All Star uh, during the All Star weekend, people tune in not only for the games itself, but it's a whole event, right? So you yeah. have stars presenting, you have um, so artists singing, you have uh, the celebrity the celebrity game on Friday, I think it is three-point contest and the dunk contest on Saturday uh, and on Sunday you have the 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 um, all-star game but it's all show so people will tune in uh, sports lovers will tune in and I think uh, it wasn't a good decision by them uh, you know what may also play a role KR I think People, if I mean, if this, if this, if this is XFL 3.0, people might think people might be a bit skeptic about its longevity. 
Yeah, that's one one of the things I want to talk about. Before I, I I go that route, I want to say shout out to Mac McClung. I was just playing with your just playing around, guy. You 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 put a good show, man. You put a good show. But to bring it back to XFL, yeah, I think I think one of the things here that first of all I didn't even know XFL was starting. I happen to be going through a couple of ESPN channels and I saw the game going on. Okay. So that was quite wild to me. I was like, oh? First I was like, what the heck is this? So you then mean- I was like, oh, it's XFL. So uh, yeah. m- maybe... Well, I would say I'm not going to say I would fit the target market, right? Well, you're I, not. It, well, I'm you're not the target yeah. market, but yeah, you're a football football lover. Yeah, which I thought I thought it was very interesting how they I think may, maybe the thing he 